Hello everyone, welcome back to Mr. Browser and today we're going to do another video on this call point. You may have seen the, uh, this video already, but uh, if you haven't seen that metal detector video, uh, open it, go and check it out. So let's get started. I actually got something from the metal detector, I actually got a battery connect and wire to 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 this stuff and the batteries inside the fit so look at this look how cool is that in a few days now I used to do some system tests and I get my uh, my system panel wise you can see what I done on the inside so look this is the battery connector where this battery is connected to look this is the battery connector for that metal detector look and screw to I wait this up by unscrewing these two screws here then put the red wire and the, and the black wire now it works look it's a red LED there you go you see it No, I don't do something. There you go. So yeah, I have a couple of these nine volt batteries around. So let me show you. See back. These are the nine volt batteries I have that I would use for my smoke detectors, and I use all of them for this. So yeah. Oh yeah, Lee. I'm going to show you something guys. So if you guys saw my first video about the status smoke detector with you. <laughs> yeah, where it's downstairs watching some TV. This gone off for some reason. And I think it falls from the really black sensor inside there. So yeah. So like, comment, wait, <laughs> let's say something is right guys, on top there says activated if you can see, there you go, and that's pretty cool, this is not the first it's with the ELO sign and some has, where you have put not in, then twist it so we can open this, so yeah. That's going to be the end of this video today. Like, comment, subscribe, and hit the notification button. Bye!